Hello and welcome to a promotional review of the game Steam Tactics, which was kindly given to me by the publisher Sometimes You and is developed by Igor Rashkuev. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. It was released on the 5th of August 2020 for a price of £8.39. It's an idea Xbox game. So, without any further ado, let's jump into this and see what this is all about. I've heard good things about this, but I'm not too sure exactly what the game is even like. But here we go. Let's start. Mission difficulty. Rewards. Okay, let's sh let's just begin. Skip this. Get straight into it. Play a turn. Move your selector with the left stick. Press A to select. Okay, available tiles are highlighted with blue. Press A to select destination. Then once more to confirm movement. Available tiles are highlighted. Yeah, okay. Uh, does that mean I can move any of them? What? Okay, let's just do that. Enemies turn. It's trying to kill me now. Targets show tiles that the ship can attack. The color of the target symbolizes associated guns. Does it now? Yep. Can we not move at all? Oh, we can. Well, why didn't I fire back? Right, let's move there. Oh, okay. Right, you have to, like, manually select them. Right. Okay. Up to a good start. Yeah, we are. Enemy level 6. How do I know what level I am? Cargo? Oh, okay. Right, here we go. This is in our cargo bay. Hangar. You can use hangar to equip your ship. Just keep in mind your ship's load. It affects your distance your ship can move in combat. Ah, uh, right. Okay. I'm with you now, game. I understand. Bridge. Oh, we have skill points and stuff. Right. Okay. Menu. No, we want to go back to the map. Right? Yes. Okay. Level 2. I like that you can skip the story bit, like the, the useless stuff you don't want to know about. You can just go straight past it. Alright, we want to put one here and one there. Okay. I want to move it here. Yes. And then attack that. Okay, cool. Now I want to move this. Nope, not to there. Right, can we move it there? Right, that won't let me attack there either. Moving there. Can I go anywhere where I can attack something? Let's just move it down here, because I don't think that's a very good spot for that to be in. Right. Play a turn. Doesn't let me attack the area I want to attack. That. So I can attack that. Yes. Okay. This is a lot easier than I thought. Let's go there and attack him. That's one down. It's turn based, but it's very cool. Nope. Nope. You kind of have to get used to the control of it. Is that in my spot? That's literally in my spot. Um, We want to move him here to attack that. And then we want to move that there to attack that. Yes. Okay. Just one enemy left.
Go there, so I can shoot through my own teammate. You can shoot through your own teammates. That's a new one for me. Flying through this. Level... 3 workshop? Oh my god, okay. New weapon. I have a new weapon? Do I? Somewhere? Red Hound, a woodpecker. Oh, you can have more than one! Okay. What's in my workshop? What can I build? I have spare parts. Upgrade. 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 Okay. Let's continue on. Right. I'm moving there is not going to help. Moving there is not going to help, so... Oh, shit. There would be a great... Let's just... Let's just end my turn there to see what the enemy does. Alright, that's fine. That'll be him dead. Okay. Now, I want to move him sort of there to attack that. Okay. Easy does it. Take him one at a time. So that's him. And that should be him. Now he's going to attack me there, so I should move two to the left, and then I have the advantage. And that's him dead. Oh no, he's still alive. But I still have him. Where I can do that. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. We've leveled up a pilot. Skill points, right. Okay. Piloting. Wits. Uh, HP for every five points. Okay. Reflexes. Plus one damage. Plus one damage. Let's add one, 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 one. Like that. Confirm. This guy then do the same thing. Maybe add one to the top instead for this guy. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Uh, workshop? Yep. Iron Moth. Increase that level. Upgrade the Red Hound. And the North Wind. Just upgrade everything I can. Okay. That's all my upgrades done. Let's move on. Pretty cool game. I rate it. Um, I can only do one at a time. That's annoying. That's very, very annoying. <laughs> hmm. Why can that thing shoot twice and I can only shoot once? That doesn't seem fair. I'm getting absolutely slaughtered here. Holy crap. Hold on a second. I might want to do this one first. Oh, it's going to not be able to reach... What do I do? I have to take out him. And how do I get that top one? This is not going to be enough room. Yeah, I knew it was going to kill me. I'm going to die. Uh 
Oh my god. It's over. How come they get to attack me twice? That I don't understand. Maybe I have to go back to a previous level to get some more upgrades. Hmm. Maybe. Gravity Spectrum? I'm not sure here. I'm really not sure. Okay, let's try that one again, but I feel like I have to work together with my team here to be able to kill them. Attack that. Oh, it's just frustrating. I'm going to have to attack something. Right, that's that thing dead. Great. That's that thing dead. Oh, yikes, that hit me. That hit me bad. Right. That's him attacked. Oh, even if I move there, it's not going to be enough. Right, he's dead. One left. That's one. I knew that wasn't going to be enough. Might lose one ship, but that should be okay. Nope. There. Boom. Done. Okay. You just have to take your time a little. Sometimes they can be a little more difficult than it seems. Upgrade them. That's them upgraded. Bridge. Um, let's upgrade some of this stuff. Yeah, that's good to me. Okay, continuing on. Merchant. Hello? We can buy stuff and sell stuff. Okay. Why do I have loads of guns, but I'm not using them? Woodpecker and a red hound. Old Bobby. And a bulldog. That's what I should have, right? Whatever, let's continue on. Let's continue on. Oh my god, right. 4v2. I'm gonna have to move him there to move him there okay lots of movements going on right now he's dead he's dead not quite oh no he's a flamethrower I didn't know they had other weapons like that. Oh god. Move back and hit. Move there and hit. Yes. Okay. Good. I'm attacking a little more. One. Two. One left. He's done. There we go. I think I just upgraded one. Yes, I did. Oh, I have another person to take care of now. Okay. She has what's called the Hornet workshop. Oh my god. Okay. What level is her thing? Level 3. Level 2 things need upgrading first. Yep. All that is fine. K. 
Okay. Moving on. Now I have three to take care of. Right. Wow. Okay. Is that going to let me? No. Okay, is that going to let me? No. I can't even attack, so I'm ending my turn. Right. He's blocked me in. So I need to figure out a way to get out of this. He's almost dead. No. Need to go there. And then there. And attack that. Wow. He's still alive? How strong are these things? Okay. How do I get rid of this thing? Let's move her... ...there, so I can attack that thing. This thing... ...needs to move again. Actually, no, I'm going to keep it there and attack that. Because then it can't attack me back. And then this is going to have to attack that as well. Right. One ship dead. Okay, one for one. Going to have to move her somewhere where I can attack in a better advantage position. Like that. And this guy's trapped, so... Right, we're not far off now. I'm gonna have to move her down here. Ah, oh, is there a way I can get that? No. I have to end my turn there. Oh my god. Okay, we're still in it. That's going to have to do that. He's going to have to come out of there to try and kill that one. Yes, just. Not far off now. Oh shit. Got literally one ship left. Yes! One heart remaining, literally. Alright. This is a pretty fun game so far. I'm enjoying it. We need to upgrade the ships themselves. And now... The level 3 weapons. But I'm enjoying this a lot. This is great. Dead simple. Really, really simple to follow. I'm going to go back to the main menu. I'm going to give my review now, because I've been playing for like 19 minutes, so... This is overall okay. It's pretty fun. The art style is unique when it has little cutscenes and things that you have to go through, but you can skip through, through all, all the way through that. I enjoy this. Probably going to give it... A... out of 10. That's what I'm giving it, a 7.2 out of 10. Because it's an average game, it's quite fun, it's nothing spectacular, but it's a turn-based... How would I put it? It's almost like Yu-Gi-Oh in a way, where you're moving things around a board, or... It's a strategy turn-based game, is what I'd say to describe it as. 
top-down view, upgradable components and ships, unique storyline. Not too bad. Music's quite relaxing, quite a chill game to just chill with. And I rate it. I really, I do. I'll give it a 7.2 out of 10. That's what I'm giving it. But thank you very much for watching this, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you all in the next one.